What's up, you guys? Welcome back to another episode of the Super Sim Challenge. We are going to go ahead and get right into the gameplay. But first, two things. I want to ask you guys to please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you are not. Um, it really helps out the channel, and I'd really appreciate it. We're trying to get to a thousand subs, and we're we're getting there, slowly but surely. So I would appreciate any help I can get with that, and that would just include you guys making sure you subscribe. Alright, also let's get into the off-camera happenings. There were a couple of things. Ellie was promoted. Uh, this was her last promotion, so she is maxed out on the secret agent career and we can start thinking about leaving that career and moving on to the next thing which is probably going to be going back to school i'll have her stay in this job until her scholarship results come back which i already have her queued up to apply and then she can enroll in school all right the other thing is we finally found the cure, the recipe for the were werewolf cure. Um, it was in Greg's diary. I had to keep reading it until it finally popped up. So we can make that. And all we have to do is make it, drink it, and then we are done with the werewolf aspirations, all of them. Now, um, the only thing left to do, and we already have the point in hand we just have to go ahead and spend it so I think that was the last thing we've already we caught the fish which isn't a werewolf thing we finished the collection and I think that's it if you guys have seen anything in other uh, people's gameplay for the werewolf pack anything that I might have missed that is pertinent to this challenge please be sure to let me know it shouldn't be a problem to go back and uh, get bit get returned and uh, finish whatever i may have missed so um, as far as i know that's it so you guys be sure to let me know if there is anything that i was not aware of so i think the way this works Okay, so this isn't going to turn green. We just use the ability point. It's like a redemption thing. So we use the ability point and it turns into 250 satisfaction points. So this is not going to turn green, but we are complete here. We've got all of the werewolf abilities. So we're done. Um, let's see. Oh, and while we're here, I figured out, or I said there was a problem, or it seemed like there was a problem with the aging up. As far as I can tell, Gary is continuing to age up. The puppies have aged up to adults. Ellie is fluctuating. She goes back and forth between 15 and 16 days until aging up. But I think she's kind of stuck there because of this immortal wolf ability and um, this is an ability that allows her to live forever as long as she's a werewolf so we'll keep an eye on it and if things don't go back to normal after she turns back into a human then we'll have to look into it further but i think this is what's causing it All right so speaking of our doggos here is Indiana. It's a full adult now. So here's Wendy. She is also a full adult. I'm not sure where that dress came from. But there she is. So I've also found out that Ellie has two new baby siblings. Uh, it didn't give me the pop-up you know sometimes people will call and ask if you want to come and see their new baby or it'll show up in the neighborhood stories I did not see it in either of those things 
but I looked in, actually her mom popped up for a visit and she was all the way pregnant. So I assume she had twins because there's a baby boy and a baby girl and she's still asking me if she should have more babies. So we'll go over and meet the new siblings at some point. We might do that in this video, we might not. But there are quite a few things I want to accomplish. We are definitely going to get through with, uh, get through with the werewolf stuff. Uh, we finally got a dirty shower and a dirty tub, so we can do that and finish this milestone that we're stuck on. And I do believe that's what Ellie's going to do next. Also, these two want to get engaged. Uh, they both have it as their whims, and I've pinned them for both of them. So we will probably try to get them engaged maybe by the end of this video. We'll see what happens if we have enough time. Okay, I think this is it. So eSports is we would have to join the esports team athletics we'd have to join the soccer team i don't think we're going to do that right now so let's just go here that'll be the last one oh, her mom's outside and yeah she's i don't know it's kind of hard to tell in that top but i don't think she's pregnant anymore or i should say pregnant again because she's already had the two babies Alright, so I think we'll have her shower three times in a row to go ahead and get it done with. Alright, that milestone is complete. So we've had, we need to look out for these filth fiends that pop up. We've had a few, you may or may not have noticed our rug is missing. It's because a filth fiend popped up right there and they seem to set everything on fire. So we've had three or four different fires throughout the house um, because I didn't realize I could just step on them and get rid of them. But when another one pops up, actually we need three more, looks like, so we'll do that. Uh, we need to throw a party in the filthy house and knock over three trash cans. We have work tomorrow, so maybe we can plan a party for Saturday. I think a late night party will be just fine. All right, so we've got everything set up. We're gonna have it take place at nine, so in about 50 minutes. And I just invited Ellie's family and her werewolf friends, but it looks like, I don't know, it looks like it took off her family. All right, but I guess we'll go with what we've got. And I think this will be a turning human party. All right, so we switch back over to the Cure Seeker aspiration and we're going to craft this wolf be gone oh. Whoa. oh she's only level five mixology I was about to say she shouldn't be that bad but she's got her certificate but she's still only level five. All right, here we go. Here is the party. Oh, let's make sure we unlock the door. All right, so we finally got one person to come up. I don't know if everyone else is downstairs or if they will make their way up here eventually. Gary's gonna make some food, which might not be a good idea because he is not very good. Alright, so it looks like the guests are, one pack is in one room and the other pack is in another room. Okay, we've got people right, eating food, we need a cake. 
Okay, so I need to make a cake real quick. Alright, so we've got the different rare, different werewolves sitting at the same table. That's nice. I still don't know how to get the Sims to listen to the stereo at the same time. So we need to at least get through with our socializing. Oh, and there's our cake. Alright, we've got we've got gold. I'm gonna go over here and we'll see how this works. I'm not really gonna worry about the rest of this since we've already got gold. Alright, so I did say this was going to be a turning human party, so let's go ahead and take our cure before the timer runs out because we want to make sure we get back to the other aspiration. Now, where is my cure? Oh, it's right here. Okay. Well, I'm glad nobody else grabbed that. Alright, Ellie has gained the werewolf ally trait due to her past experience as a werewolf and aspiration complete fangs for the memories even if they weren't so great ellie has successfully cured her lycanthropy now that fury is no longer knocking on her door where will life take her hopefully completing a full day of work that's one place i hope it takes her all right so we are completely done with the werewolf aspirations. There were five of them. So we'll just go back to Fabulously Filthy and finish out this party. Okay, we've only got a few more minutes left and we'll be done here. Alright, great party. We've got a new stereo. Alright, let's not do this again. So, are you kidding? So we just wasted all that time and it didn't work? Now, I know this has got to be filthy. Yeah, floor level is filthy. Use your phone to throw a skip. Is it because I didn't use my phone? If so, that's the dumbest thing I've ever heard. Alright, so I guess we'll have to try that again. Since we need more... Oh, good. Since we need more pets, I think I'm going to go ahead and encourage these two to mate and have some puppies okay so let's see if anything happens there so i wonder if it will tell you if they're going to have puppies all right so both of them have work at two which means they have plenty of time to get some stuff done i'm actually gonna go ahead and do another aspiration We'll go here and uh, we will mount five of these. We have so many of them. All right. So we need catch five fish using bait and make six great catches. All right. We are going to go actually right down here. We'll just bring Gary with us so he doesn't clean up too much while we're gone. I don't know where I want them to get engaged. I almost don't think it even matters. I'll probably take them somewhere to take some pictures. But just for the sake of actually popping the question, I guess. Alright, so they are both going to go to work. And we'll see you guys when they get back. Alright you guys, Ellie is back from work, 
and I sent her straight back to the little fishing area to see if we can get some <clears throat> excuse me get some of these things done she has to catch five fish using bait so we've got that going we've got one oh, and we've already got two great catches I'm not sure what counts for that but we've got them all right so Ellie just needs one more fish and she'll be done here All right, there it is. All right, we've got our filth fiend, so I'm gonna let Ellie go ahead and eat. And I'm going back to the fabulously filthy. All right, so we'll send her over to appease this filth fiend. super weird. So as long as it doesn't set itself on fire, we should be able to do this a couple more times. And then we can throw a party, do a little woohoo. I want to at least get them engaged first, but I don't know. Alright, we can appease one more time. All right, there we go. Now let's get rid of it so it doesn't start a fire. Well, I think what we'll do is just have a party while Gary is at work. Just so we can go ahead and get that over with. And before he goes to work, we'll get them engaged. And woohooed. Okay, so it looks like Ellie's scholarship result letters have come. Right, let's see if we can open these up and see what we've got. Alright, we've got workplace, we've got building the future, food and drink. We did not get friend of the animals. Right, great outdoors, super scout, and future star check this one out that's the San Machino resident uh, we didn't get that one okay so I think I want these two to go downstairs well, they can at least be in decent moods let's go ahead and propose you may huh? Oh, oh, yes. Horrid <laughs> Well, be. Oh, Blaine Houston. <laughs> it's fine. Oh. <laughs> Yanki, Yanka. All right. They are officially engaged. I will put them in some kind of decent outfits and take some pictures off camera so we don't have to sit through all that it'll take forever let's go ahead and get this in before Gary goes to work Break out the candles, make it romantic. A little privacy, even though the walls are down. Okay, there is that. Okay, so Ellie needs to plan a party. And I guess that's it. Finish an entire juice keg, so we have to do that. We need to buy one first. Okay, so we've got this already. I guess the problem was we might not have been on on this when we planned the party. 
because this checked off right away. So since this is done, we can go on to this. If this doesn't work, at least this one should by the end. Oh, this is a complete failure. Dang, this is hard. Oh, it's not letting me tell jokes. Uh, I can't get anything done. Oof, yikes. Alright, let's try again. Alright, I think this... This might actually work. No, you cannot go to bed. What is happening right now? Don't you dare. What are you doing? Get out. What is this? I'm so confused. Please get out before your fiance comes home. Too late. Oh my god. Alright, this is a mess. I can't... Please get out of the bed. Okay, so we're just stuck here. I don't... I don't know what's happening. Ugh, goodness gracious. I... Well, wish I had thought about that sooner. But that was rough. It, I don't know if something was glitched. I don't know what happened, but that did not go well at all. If I had remembered to reset, reset these two when they got stuck in the bed, then we would have had more time to finish. Alright, well, at least we were able to get this part of Fabulously Filthy done. I think we'll get up early before she goes to work. We'll go and work on this, and we'll go over to her parents' house. They actually have two trash cans, so we can probably knock them over, pick them up, and knock them over again. And maybe we can see the babies if they invite us in, because I just remember the doors are locked at their house. So we might not be able to see them. Okay, we will announce our engagement. Right, so I guess we'll need to do some planning. Uh, let's kick these over. Yeah, I don't think we're going to be able to actually get inside. The doors are both locked. So I think what I'll do is go over um, I'll play in this household and since aging is off for the outside households I will age up the babies into toddlers and we'll see what they look like when they come back okay aspiration is complete Ellie has become one with the filth and finds solace in the familiar presence of dirt and grime. As Ellie learned to let messes pile up and live it up, she found enlightenment. Why bother cleaning when things will just get dirty again? Why hold yourself to some impossible standard of cleanliness? Once Ellie embraced and accepted her filthy ways, she realized she was free. And on this day, a filth dweller was born. That's it, another aspiration complete, and we can finally clean the house. Is that it's getting horrible? The bad thing about this is we need to clean the house all the way, get it to perfectionist, and then we have to let dust bunnies or filth fiends pile back up. Let's see if we can get inside. Oh, okay, I must have unlocked it already. 
So where are the babies? Oh, they're down here in her old room. And it doesn't look like anybody's taking care of them. It looks like it's giving me the option to age them up, so we'll try it out. Here's our little brother. He's cute. Alright, so this is little Calvin. Oh, okay. And here's Juliet. I can still sniff an hold on please hold on now I'm not a werewolf anymore so should I still be able to do this no, they're not werewolves are they there's no way okay all right so it looks like they are they are both Landon's okay. I guess I still have some residual werewolf stuff for whatever reason. So we'll come back and try to set this house up for toddlers. At least get them some beds. All right. Well, that was a nice little visit. So here are our new little siblings. And I think we'll go ahead and end this episode right here. We've got an aspiration done. We'll get to work on um, maybe party animal. I'm not sure yet. I'll figure it out. But uh, we did get some stuff done. We met our two new family members. I did not host a successful party. At least not the keg party. But the first one was good so at least we have that <laughs> but anyway guys thank you so much for watching be sure to like comment and subscribe and i will see you in the next video bye